We're more than halfway through this year's fantasy football season, and now it's time for players to shine. Certain players that you either drafted that were supposed to produce that are now starting to come along, or players that you pick up on waivers halfway through the year that are starting to produce for the rest of the season. One of those guys is Kirk Cousins. Kirk Cousins, throughout his career, has always been an up-and-down fantasy quarterback. He has consistently produced at certain levels, but he's also consistently produced at bad levels. This guy has been the epitome of average. He really has. But when he's on fire and when he starts to click, the sky's the limit for him and his team. Over the past three weeks, Kirk Cousins has done nothing but destroy fantasy statistics. He has over 108 points in three games. He's passed for 1,100 yards, 10 touchdowns, only throw one pick. He's averaging 34 points per game in fantasy football. This guy is starting to click. That team is starting to click. When you have Dalvin Cook, when you have Adam Thielen, when you have Stephon Diggs, even Kyle Rudolph is a serviceable tight end for either fantasy or NFL as long as he's being targeted. But there's just so many footballs to go around. All I know is Kirk Cousins is ready to take off. He started three weeks ago. He's going to continue for the rest of the year. He is a guy that you can get behind, put in your lineup, and not look back. And to think that he was only owned in 30% of fantasy leagues up to last week. This is a guy who's probably on waivers. This is a guy who could be somebody's second quarterback. This is a guy you target if you have a guy that's inconsistent like a Jameis Winston in your lineup that you probably drafted real high or a Baker Mayfield that you drafted to be your number one. I go all in with Kirk.